Their stories are all different and all heartbreaking. King County homicide cases that have grown cold with no new leads. Some date back to the 1980s. We have about 200 roughly uh, cold cases that, that we feel are still solvable. And those include missing person cases that are presumed homicides. Now, new technology could mean new leads, and it's all in the palm of your hand. King County Automated Fingerprint Identification System, APHIS, is launching a new generation computer, the MorphoTrack product, has the ability to search palm prints as well as fingerprints. Our old APHIS only had the first digits of the, the finger, so the very tips of the finger, and now we have the entire palm. So you can see that's a, a lot more information to work with. It's a huge breakthrough. Uh, we've never had the ability to search a palm print through an automated uh, fingerprint system. In the past, print examiners could only match palm prints if they had a known suspect. Now, unknown palm prints from a crime scene can be compared to the entire APHIS database of more than 340,000 sets of prints. It has the technology to search uh, millions of prints and uh, in, in a fraction of the time it would, uh, that we could possibly do it. Now we're able to bring those prints up on screen and enlarge them, uh, maybe make them a little bit darker, a little bit lighter by, uh, by enhancing, and then we're able to mark those characteristics side by side that are similar. At least 30% of latent prints left at a crime scene are palm prints. In King County, we've collected palm prints from, from people as they're booked for many years. It's just that we could only use them in a manual way, but now we can electronically search those prints against the crime scene prints. It could mean new clues in cold cases, like the murder of 16-year-old Sarah Yarborough. In 1991, the Federal Way High School cheerleader's body was found near the school's running track on a Saturday morning. Witnesses had seen the suspect trying the doors on the school and looking in the windows of the school. Some of the prints that they collected were palm prints, so that's one of the cases we submitted to this new database. The database will continue to grow as more individuals are arrested or inmates are booked. It's important to bring people to justice and then for the families it's, it's important for them to know somebody isn't giving up on these and still working them and, and trying to solve them. Under the management of the King County Sheriff's Office, APHIS is a regional service for all law enforcement agencies within King County. It is funded through a property tax levy. If you have information on any case, you can call the Sheriff's Department at 206-296-3311.